హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ దిస్ ఈజ్ యూర్ ప్రశాంత వెల్కమ్ టు పైతాన్ ఆటోమేషన్ సెల్లింగ్ సిరీస్ టుడే వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు సీ ద వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ టాపిక్ ఇస్ సెలెక్ట్ డ్రాప్ డౌన్ అండ్ బ్రౌజర్ కమాండ్స్ ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ వాట్ ఇస్ అ డ్రాప్ డౌన్ సో డ్రాప్ డౌన్ లైక్ లైక్ ఇఫ్ ఐఎమ్ సెలెక్టింగ్ ఎ మల్టిపుల్ ఆప్షన్స్ ఐ కెన్ సెలెక్ట్ ఎనీ వన్ సో దట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ లైక్ ఎ డ్రాప్ డౌన్స్ ఓకే సో ఐఎమ్ రైట్ నా ఐఎమ్ రైట్ క్లికింగ్ క్లికింగ్ ఆన్ ఇన్స్పెక్ట్ ఓకే విల్ సీ హౌ ద డిజైన్ ఇస్ సో బేసికలీ మోస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ద డ్రాప్ డౌన్స్ ఆర్ స్టార్ట్ విత్ ద సెలెక్ట్ ట్యాగ్ సీ దిస్ సెలెక్ట్ ట్యాగ్ under this select tag there are so many options okay each have options it have value like analytics and the black color is the text so this is the value and this is a visible text okay so let's start how to select using in a drop down so basically we need to find the web element in which web element the select is okay so in this select tag i'm seeing the attribute type class and id so i add a id so i'm copying this id value and inside i am creating one web element like this is select web element so i am naming like this user defined variable so you can give any name so select web element equal to driver dot find element by dot right now i am copying the id value id and i am pasting the value as this one so right now this select web has the web element of select okay next thing we need to have import the select class so only using select class we can able to select a drop down so how to import from cell name web driver support select and i am importing a select class okay i am going to create a object for this like select equal to select class in this class i want to pass the web element that already we select a web element for select web element right so that's why i'm passing it okay so there are three types of ways to identify a drop down okay one is by index another one is value and visible text so we will see one by one so index means if this index start from 0 1 2 3 4 like 1 2 3 suppose i want to select android okay this is comes under 1 0 1 2 3 4 5 okay i want to give what is my object name select sl dot select by index i am giving what 5 okay this will select a fifth element okay next is value what is value suppose i want to use the value to select right now i want to select a configuration that means i'm copying the configuration value of the configuration i'm giving like select dot select by value and i want to pass the value okay and what is visible text visible text is the black color letters so it's visible in a screen so whatever is visible in a screen that we represent in a black color letter so in case i want to select a design okay i'm copying the design on the from the black color and i'm i'm like like select dot select by visible text so the whatever visible in a website okay we select we run one by one so i'm commenting the remaining two so i'm right click running this file right now the browser is launched the url centered i used to maximize here i'll show you how to maximize the window see this it's maximized the api got selected in the drop down okay so first of all we need to know how to maximize we need to use driver dot maximize window okay so i'm commenting this option and right now i'm selecting second so i want to select the using value i want to select the configuration so i'm running this so mostly in the industry level uh, mostly visible text only it will help on most of the cases some cases select by value so there is never use select by index because sometimes the drop down index may changed based upon the update so never that is not recommended only select by visible text or value is recommendable see this configuration is selected okay so this is how we need to select the each web elements okay see this select by index i'll be value and final one is what select by visible text so i'm running all three so which is we last used we are using last is select visible text so it will select a index by then it will select a configuration finally it will end up with the see here first it is selecting the api configuration finally see this design got selected okay in this place okay these are the selection operations so what are the navigation is okay suppose in case right now i'm in this in this url how to move to another url so i'm giving like 
driver dot get method and I want to pass the URL. See here, yeah? right now I'm giving a Google URL. So what will happen from this page to it will go to the new page. Okay. What is back? So if I move to Google, so I want how to come back. I, I'm going to use a driver dot back. So it will back to the this URL. Okay. And so how to refresh? We need to use driver dot refresh method. It will use to refresh. Suppose I want to again go to Google. So what I will do? Simply driver dot forward. So forward is moving to uh, next screen like where we was a previous one. Back is like it's going back. Okay. So I'm right, right click it running on this class. So right now what will do? It will go to the Google. So I'm telling uh, Google it's went to Google and we use a back button like uh, see this, this is the back option. So this is the same action will happen on driver dot back. See this again it's going to the registration page and here it will do the refresh. See this it's refreshing the page. Okay. And again we used what forward. So from the registration page, once the registration page is completed, see this right now is refreshing. So again it's moving to the Google. Okay. What are the other comments I taught you previously? Like how to quit the driver. So driver dot quit. Okay. Quit will close the browser. Okay. So for maximize minimize, we can use driver dot maximize or driver dot minimize. Okay. Okay. The last topic is suppose I want to know the what is the current URL. So in this place, I want to know what is the current URL. So I'm printing like print. So driver dot current URL. So in this place after moving here, so I'm again printing. So driver dot current URL. So this is the previous time the URL is this. When I move to the new URL, my current URL will change. Okay. I'm run right click and running here. See here. The page got loaded. After that, it will move to the uh, Google. Okay. Once moving to the loading the into Google, it will again back. We use the back button. So it will back to the previous URL. See this? Finally, it's moved to the driver dot close. See this? The first URL is driver dot automation. Next URL is what? It's Google. So finally, we quitting a browser. The browser automatically will get close. Okay. So if you like the video, please subscribe and share to your friends. If you have faced any issues, please put me in the comment. I will help you out there. Thanks for joining in.